Yes, people, please hit that subscription button, notification button for daily contents. So we're going to be speaking about midfield and a player we're linked with uh, from Borussia Dortmund. And furthermore, we're going to be speaking about how we can make that midfield solid in the near future as well. So let's do this, people. Let's do this. Yes, people, welcome to LFC Red Forever Channel. So we're going to be speaking about Jude Bellingham, as everybody knows, worst kept secret, probably in football. Worst kept secret in football, maybe? I don't know. Yeah, so according to the Mail uh, news outlet, they're saying Liverpool are confident they are in poor position to sign Jude Bellingham next summer. Hmm. As Manchester City close in on 45 million deal for Calvin Phillips instead Calvin Phillips is the Leeds player everybody knows he's an England international he's a regular in the England team with Declan Rice in that midfield for for, for England as well so uh, be aware he's a good player um, but Red's midfield target is valued at a huge 80 million by Borussia Dortmund hmm what can I say about that people um, are we willing to wait another summer are we just going to sit here and see how it goes because that's all we get at Liverpool Football Club. Next summer, next summer, next summer. Are we willing to wait? I don't know. I'm not, I'm not waiting. I'm about, I'm about here and now. You know what I mean? After the pandemic we had, you don't know what's going to happen in the world. So, and uh, we're only what one or two midfielders short of challenging for the title next season. Like probably winning the title next season. You know, midfielders that's uh, like consistent and don't pick up a lot of injuries. That's what I'm talking about. Um, with Jude Bellingham, listen, from what I've heard from my mates like around uh, the social medias, he's a great young prospect. He can like the Premier League, but they said the same thing about Jadon Sancho. How did he turn out? Timo Werner, how did he turn out? You know what I mean? Like, that's just what you've got to look at, people. It's not always about uh, um, hearsay and people judging players. If they haven't played the game, they don't, they don't understand it a lot either. So, it's, it's, it's a difficult it's a difficult situation so are we willing to wait next summer are we patient enough I don't think so because the, fa the fans are like disarray at the moment and they melt down and they're not happy about us not buying a midfielder as uh, as like myself as well myself I think we need midfielders here and now I'm not willing to wait another season because you don't know what's going to happen tomorrow people like we talk about tomorrow a lot like it's a, it's it's an easy thing to say. Anything can happen in life, uh, and we've got to be careful how we go on about that. The owners have to like step up now, and start spending their money. And Klopp, he needs to like say enough is enough. Let's let's challenge. Let's let's try win this league title and get the, the players we need. Um, I'm I'm all in for Jude Bellingham people, but is he the B or N all? I don't know. Is he the, the, the midfielder that's going to replace the likes of Gerard in that midfield for the future? I don't know. I mean, if he was that good, why didn't the teams in the Premier League chase him when he was at Birmingham? You know what I mean? There's a lot of things you've got to think about before, like, we just jump in and, and, and trying to say, like, this kid's going to be brilliant and all this stuff. We said that we said that about a lot of players. Never performed in the Premier League. Probably sold back to those clubs. So... Yeah, um, we'll have to wait and see. 80 million is a lot of money for this kid as well, in my opinion. Why a Man City buying Calvin Phillips for 45 million, who's an established England player? This kid is not even an established England player, and we're gonna try signing for 80 million because of his age. <laughs> is, is, is it a robbery? Most probably, yeah. Most probably, yeah. But I'm about here and now, like, people. Like, we need midfielders here and now, and, um, 
if we keep looking to the future, it's the wrong way to go about it. But like I always say, people, like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you. I'll see you soon.